Hey there everybody! So with yesterday's fantastic news that the interest rate has dropped by another full percentage point, I thought I'd make this quick video just to explain to you exactly where you are standing in this situation. So if we go back to our previous model where we looked at what you would save on 1 million Rand, your new interest saving would be 150,629 Rand. And then your monthly saving will be 628 Rand from the previous level. So the question becomes, what will this cost you per month if you were to buy a property now? Well, let's look at a couple of examples for common prices that you find in the Kempton Park area. Let's say, for example, you bought a townhouse at 750,000 Rand and you got a bond for that same number over 20 years at prime rate of 7.75%. Your monthly repayment would be 6,157 Rand and 50 cents. If you bought a property for 1 million Rand, your monthly repayment would be 8,210 Rand per month. And if you bought a beautiful property for 1.25 million Rand, your repayment would be 10,262 Rand and 50 cents. And if you bought a beautiful three bedroom home for 1.5 million Rand, your repayment would be 12,315 Rand. So is this enough to entice you to buy a new property? <laughs> well, it certainly should be. But there are a couple of other issues that we can tackle in the meantime to assist you as the purchaser even more during this buying process. And our friends at BetterBond have these two suggestions for us. The first one is that we raise the threshold of transfer duties from 1 million Rand up to 3 million Rand, but that we only do this for a six month period. This will help South African buyers to purchase new properties, but then also save a couple of extra Rand on the side. The second thing we can do, open up the deeds offices albeit with a skeleton staff. Put the necessary protocols and health measures in place to keep those few staff members safe during this pandemic and make sure that purchasers who are currently in limbo get the opportunity to move into their new homes. Consider that in a typical month, the deeds office registers between 10 to 12,000 properties and that last year in April, 12 billion rands worth of properties had transferred through that office. This means that the property sector is a major contributor to the average GDP of South Africa and it is extremely important that we do everything we can to keep our economy going forward by keeping the property sector healthy. Thanks for watching everybody. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to like, comment and subscribe and also stay tuned for more informative videos from me. And lastly, remember, always talk to the experts. Cheers for now.